Hi Scorpio and welcome to my channel. It's quite a new channel so I'd love to hear from some of you in the comments if anything I say resonates. Obviously it may not resonate so if that's the case maybe check your other signs but this is for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. So Scorpio I picked up on your energy as I was dealing and shuff um, shuffling the cards and it was quite heavy um, I'm feeling in some of you maybe a small group of you uh, quite a lot of heartache at the moment or you've been through this recently now in your past there was some sort of clarity something came to light for you, you saw through the fog and this led you to become single, to become strong on your own and independent. I'm feeling here it's the end of a marriage for some of you or a relationship. At the moment we've we've got this six of wands so this speaks of victory and working hard. I think that to keep your mind occupied a lot of you are working. This victory may pertain to a court case uh, regarding a divorce because this is our marriage card. So it could be the end of, of this situation for you. Now in your subconscious we've got the devil which could be a Capricorn but I'm sensing this is a codependent relationship you haven't quite detached from the past and from this person who has been in your life for quite a long time I feel pretty long relationship or marriage I think and your obstacle seems to be this partner now it could be an Aries, um, male or female, but I'm picking up on a masculine energy here. This person is independent, quite dominant, bossy, maybe a business owner. And it seems this is the person who has broken your heart, really hurt you in some way. It may have been a third party situation Okay, may go the other way, but I feel that this is this person that put you through this. Now, externally, we've got the Justice card. So, this does link to what I said earlier about maybe you have been through the justice system and you've come out in a positive light, so things have gone in your favour. Could also be a Libra who's around you, a friend or family member who I feel is helping you in with that energy. Okay, the guidance is to just stop and assess now your finances because this may have ruptured things for you in your financial situation and just look at how you want to move forward with things now. In your potential outcome, we got the High Priestess. So this speaks of being in intuitive and looking internally at that knowledge, that inner knowledge and wisdom that you have in terms of moving forward in the way you want to. And also trying to look at things um, from different angles. So if any of you are feeling a little bit down in the dumps, like nothing's going to go your way, negative thinking, try to meditate and just stop and reflect and try to see the positivity around you, okay? And we got the chariot card which indicates forward movement. So. You, you will move forward from this situation, okay? You may be travelling, 
maybe going on holiday or you may be moving so you're completely going to move away from this past situation that's what I'm sensing for a lot of you in your future you're going to break away completely and I feel for a lot of you what I'm getting is moving is what I'm hearing moving will help you to completely get away okay I'm going to pull a few oracle cards for you now okay we've got assurance there there you go so for those of you who are feeling a bit insecure unsure you've got assurance okay and this connection with trees here so maybe going out into nature can help you to feel grounded and we've got be in service so some of you may be working in service of others and if not if that's what you want to do then go for it I would say maybe this is your new change you're moving on to something new in your life for yourself okay and we've got vulnerability here notice this little child in a leaf okay so this to me speaks of connecting with your inner child going within and doing things for yourself in order to feel good about yourself and to feel safe as well okay Scorpio that's all I have for you today I hope you've enjoyed the reading and hope to see you